So this past winter, we were drilling a scientific drill core right in the parking lot of the museum to try to learn more about the geology of Colorado and what's beneath our feet. And in the process of drilling that hole, we ran into something we never thought we'd find, a dinosaur. When I heard it was a dinosaur, I said, holy guacamole. I mean, wow. I mean, that's your Willy Wonka moment. It's like a once in a lifetime, right? Pretty exciting. And, and who would have thought it would have happened here in the parking lot of the museum? Where we actually have boatloads of those dinosaurs on display and down in our collections. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. You're basically taking a core of rock that, that's big around and drilling down, you know, hundreds and hundreds of yards below the surface. So the chances of you hitting a dinosaur are infinitesimally small. So this dinosaur was 763 feet below the surface of our parking lot. It's the deepest and it's the oldest dinosaur in the city of Denver. It turns out this looks to be from the backbone or a vertebra from a plant-eating dinosaur that lived at about 67 million years ago in what is today Denver. So if we think about the landform today around Denver and right here in City Park, of course, we see grass and trees. But if we go just below the surface, when we get below the soil, we start seeing rock that was deposited at the end of the age of dinosaurs. So at about 67 million years ago, and there were big river systems and swamps and things and that, that's what's represented under your feet. So next time you go out and you're digging a hole in your backyard, keep digging, you'll get past the soil and you'll get to this rock that's actually of dinosaur age. I would love to dig a 763 foot hole in the parking lot to excavate that dinosaur, the rest of it, but I don't think that's gonna fly because we really need parking, so yeah. No plans to, to dig up City Park.